Hello, um, this is the wrap for day 02, Tuesday the 7th of June. Oh, days sort of merge. Oh, for MB08 2022 in Gloucester. Um, I'm trying something slightly new today. Um, you can see my notes, although if I look at them, they're a little bit too small. I can only just make them out, so I should look over here as well. Um, anyway, okay, so this is a look back on uh, yesterday, Tuesday, and what I did. Anyway, got up in the morning. You probably already know this. The Wi-Fi was working fine. It's still a bit glitchy, um, but it doesn't drop out anymore, which is good news. And while I was still in bed, security updates for the 3A which is still ongoing, although I don't get any of the nice new additions that some of the higher up numbers in the pixel range get, which is a shame, although I have that under control. It involves spending money in July. It's going to be an expensive summer, I can see that now, it really is. Um, Boris won. Although I have a feeling it may be a Pyrrhic victory, I don't think he's going to last that long. The Tories, as usual, when they get in power, split down the middle. A bit like all the other parties, to be perfectly honest, but um, I don't want to say lead by example, but lead by example. Definitely lead by example. Looking out of the window, although not today, because there has been overnight rain. Yesterday, there was mist, and the mist came off the water, and probably about 7 o'clock, it was really, really misty. And then the sun came out and it disappeared away. And it was really, really a nice day. And I liked it a lot. Because Flaming June, I think. Okay, so looking at the weather forecast, which didn't mention the mist. Dark sky is going away. The apps will stop working at the end of this year. And the API will stop working end of March 2023 um, although WeatherKit is now amongst us which will allow even Android apps to use the Dark Sky API which is good because I have a number of apps that do actually use it although I don't think it is good as it once was it was used to be my go-to weather forecasting now cast gets it right up now it's not that good uh, although the weather radar is something that i do like nothing ever stays the same which sometimes is good anyway um i priced a macbook here okay so i don't want the base model i need more ram so that's 16 gigabytes i need more storage so that's 512 gigabytes i'm gonna get one of the well, it looks like black, but it's actually a very, very, very dark blue. I hate to tell you what it'll be. They're not available yet anyway. I'm going to trade in this MacBook Pro, um, which won't be getting the... I can't think of the name of the upgrade. Ventura, I think it is. Um, so it's like goodbye to you. Plus the fact Intel... Bye-bye, Intel. You know, and especially Skylake, which had its issues he says okay um uh, cost of coffee <laughs> um they seem to have a staffing issue they only had one member of staff and he was from another branch and he didn't have time to put anything out so there was no bacon roll there was only a cappuccino um but there's a promotion on at the moment where after you've had one you the app points up and you have to knock beans off towers the idea is it'll knock two beans off and then for the third one it'll just sort of wobble a bit. I think mine just wobbled a bit yesterday. Although I have had a couple of free beans, eight beans to a free coffee. Gamification. Yeah, let's pop into Costa and play this game because it's fun. Or something like that anyway. We're all taking advantage of. Um, next, the Lord High Constable of England. A fruit based drink. Um, I recorded the prelude and postlude uh, to WWDC, me rabbiting on about, well, tech. 
I like my tech. You know I like my tech. And this fast Wi-Fi in there and uploaded and off we went. I was debating whether to have lunch in there because it was Steak Tuesday. But in the end, um, 10 minute walk down to the Pelican. The Pelican. Okay, it's a traditional pub. It's got fast Wi-Fi. It doesn't get overcrowded, although the locals are very friendly, and it has a beer garden out the back, which has a gazebo in for the beer festival that starts on Thursday. Mike, the landlord, is superb. Um, lots of cascales, lots of kegales, lots of ciders, untapped live updates, and tons and tons of cans, including ones from New Zealand, and a can cooler. Really, really, really good. If it would only open at 11 o'clock in the morning, though. Used to, po um, pre-Rona, um, I think they're still winding back up. But the Pelican, Gloucester, go there. It is really good. Wandered back, um, uh, got some food in Tesco's. There was someone being arrested outside Tesco's. I think drugs were involved. I could be wrong. Uh, England, they drew. Who would have thought? Anyway, um, uh, if you've got any feedback and you'd like to see my notes, um, I use a program called AppNote. Um, although I really like Apple Notes, but there are issues, especially with the web version. And there's another thought. Should I go from Windows all the way over to the Mac? I'm at cross-platform at the moment. I like cross-platform. I think that's it. Let me know. Anyway, uh, that's me waving. And bye-bye.